Very few people in the United States know a whole lot about Latin America. They do their own forms of weaving, and then the embroidery is really unique to, uh, to each village. And so you'll go in, you'll immediately know where a person is from by the clothing that they're wearing. Clothing, art, you name it. The Latin American Cultural Center gives guests an inside look at a different part of the world. It's the only Latin American cultural center in the United States that focuses specifically on the peoples and cultures and arts of Latin America. The Latin American Studies Association created the museum, buying it in 2019. Downstairs you'll find the permanent collection featuring geography and music. We kind of focused on the Caparero um, because they are a really exciting um, genre of music. The Grand Gallery is upstairs, which will feature special exhibits like Maya Spirituality. These artists have produced these beautiful paintings that you see uh, around us. They initially were selling those to tourists. Uh, eventually, as they got better at their craft, uh, it was picked up by collectors around the world. Maximon is kind of cool because he's a cigar smoking, alcohol drinking, uh, you know, wears a, wears a, a big sombrero. Uh, but he's, uh, he's, he's, he's one of their everyday saints. The experience is eye-opening for visitors like Floyd Smith. He's one of the first to explore the new center learning about Latin America. It's a big broad world and we, we can't all travel everywhere and check everything out ourselves. So this brings things to us and, and lets us see where we might want to go if we're traveling in the future. The museum is open every week, Tuesday through Thursday. You can purchase tickets online in advance. Reporting in Oakland, Ashley Zilka, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.